Hello, Georgie B back again. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. It's just a flat card with a little weather sentiment that's sticking up. I made this card using this stamp set, Flowering Rain Boots. And I've used the boots, the stems and the flowers. For the sentiment, I used Quiet Meadow and I used this Heartfelt Love and Caring Thoughts with you, plus the dots. Card, I've got a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths. Cord up four on one eighth, folded in half and burnished. I think I've got that right this time. And I've got two cards at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. One for the inside and one for the outside. The inside is plain. To keep it plain so that you can write your own message inside. And we're going to work on this. So we've got the boots first. We're going to put that down and we're going to use Mossy Meadow. I'm going to place these boots about there in the middle at the bottom. Come out really nice. Um, I'll keep that because I want to use. Oh. A blender pen just to colour in, pick up some of this mossy meadow and just colour in some of these faded bits with it. Same on the other one. We're just picking up the green off the card. Just so that they they're not white. We're now going to use Old Olive to do the stems. I've got a stem hanging off. That's it. And we're going to place these stems on the boots. I'll try and get them as if they're in the boots. And again, just colour in the white bits, drag in the ink, over the leaves. I'm going to do darker flowers this time. I'm going to do rich raspberry. <laughs> We're just going to stain my stamp. But never mind. Right. Now we've got to try and 
line up all these stamps with their stems. I think I can do that. Might not, we'll see. Yeah. And again, use the brush just to pull in the pink on the flowers. Now I need to tidy this one up because it does look like you've coloured it all in. So you just go over the dark bits. That's better. I like them darker. Never clean my thing. Right. Now what did I do? Oh, I did the spots around the um, boots or the pollen as I call it. And I should do that in pale papaya. Now I do want it light, so don't want it too dark. That's it. Now to get this frame round the um, picture, to frame it, all I did, got my ruler and roughly drew two lines. And I roughly did that all the way round the card. What a glare off the ruler. Hard to see the card. Don't matter if it's wonky or uneven, that's what I did. That is our card base, our card front done. We just need to do the sentiment, which we'll do in a minute. Let's add this to our card base.
Right, what a scrap. Use this. This. Some Versafine. And we're going to just stamp that down there. Doesn't matter if it's upside down. Because we're going to cut round it. Wonky. I'm just doing this following the letters. And then this will go there on dimensionals. Going. Mm. Right. That is my card done. Hope you like it. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my card, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload which is usually uh, Monday and Friday for now. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.